Hello, sports fans. Larry Eater with Run Blog Run. We're in Doha, Qatar, in the Run Blog Studios, and this is um, our first podcast uh, from Doha, and we're going to give you a day-by-day um, rundown of the events. This is for day one. We start at 4.30 uh, in local time, which is 6.30 a.m. in San Jose, California, 8.30 a.m. in Fort Atkinson, Wisconsin. And in uh, Peterborough, New Hampshire, it is 9.30 a.m. Um, the first event is the men's long jump qualifying. Uh, let's see some people uh, do some pretty serious jumping. Mr. Manyango, Mr. Echevarria. And there'll be some uh, pretty tough Americans in there, too. Uh, at 4.35, the men's 100-meter prelim round. This is where um, some of the top athletes... You won't see there, but you will see some very spirited athletes, and it's a lot of fun. At 440, the women's hammer throw without Anita Woodlarzik. Uh, qualification Group A should be good. Um, at 510, women's 800 meters. Who's going to do it? Castor Semenya is no longer in the event, unfortunately. Aj Wilson, can she do it? Who else can put it together? 530 p.m., women's pole vault. Katerina Stefaniti. Kati Najot, Sandy Morris, Yarlidis Silva. Who's going to put it together? Who's going to do it? It's going to be very interesting. Um, oh, and Anzalika Sidorova. God, how could I forget her? Um, men's 100-meter heats. This is when it starts getting interesting. 605 sports fans, Justin Gatlin, Christian Coleman, Andre de Gross, Akini Simbini. Could be very cool. Women's hammer throw qualification group B, 610. Women's high jump, Maria Lazanskano got beat in Brussels. And Vashti Cunningham and some very, very tough NA jumpers there. So it should be interesting. At 6.55, the women's steeplechase heats. Beatrice Chepkowicz, Emma Coburn, Courtney Frerich. It's going to be interesting. Four Kenyans in that thing. Wow. Um, at 7.25, men's triple jump, Christian Taylor, Will Clay, Omer Craddock. Uh, let's see which Europeans can get in there. Uh, that starts at 7.25. Okay, who's going to replace Mo Farah? That's the question. Men's 5,000 meter heats. It's going to be crazy. August Gabriel Hewitt, methinks. Paul Chalimo. We'll have to see uh, how this uh, party rumbles. But it's going to be interesting. That's at 7.45. Hopefully it'll start cooling down a little bit by then. Or you'll see some people go down. 8.35, the 400 meter hurdles. One of the hottest events of the whole champs, Karsten Warholm, Abdir Sanba, and Rai Benjamin. I think a couple of them are going to get under 47. I think we could see a world record. Let's just see how it goes. And the final event, starting at one minute before midnight, the Women's Marathon. What is going to happen there? That one's open. Um, it's on the side of the... Uh, a lovely Doha where we are, and uh, people will be able to watch it, but it's going to be obviously pitch black, and it could be very exciting. Uh, it's still going to be in the 80s, 90s, sports fans, so you're going to see an event like uh, Seville in 99, uh, where they go out very slow, and they come in over that last 5K crazy hard. So it should be a lot of fun. That's day one. This is Larry Eater, Run Blog Run. Signing off from Doha, Qatar. Talk to you soon.